Hi, and welcome to Exploring Tai Chi. In this session, I will continue with something that I have done early on, one of the Qigong sets in a soaring crane. As I've said before, in the system of Master Sam Tam, we have the soaring crane set Qigong, which actually emphasizes some of the things that uh, we work in with in the Tai Chi form and even in the standing. The Qigong set themselves can be practiced alone. You don't have to uh, combine it with anything. If you're interested in small and Qigong, you can practice these ones here. But also, when if you do Tai Chi and you do uh, standing meditation and so on, it's very, very a uh, good idea to work with these things for a period. This one is the third set of the Soren Crane. And this one works especially with the spine. And it also, uh, in the tradition of uh, Chinese medicine, it work, uh, in enforces uh, energy in the kidney and thereby also enforces the uh, energy in the, all the bones in the body. Uh, in the first part, I just show it briefly to get you into uh, remember it. We stand it out in the Wuchi standing, then we were working with the spine like moving in curves like this, and then we took the neck, then we moved up, moved down, then we work with the lower part of the spine, different directions, moving up. Then we were doing the turning, where we, the hand was coming close to the ear, making a little sound there. And that was about it. In the last part of the set, we will work with the uh, legs, and we will also work with rotations of, uh, of the spine and the midsection. So, after doing this one here, we end up down here. Then we open up the left foot, shift the weight to the left, balance, lift up, kick out. And like I did right now, it's actually quite good that I did it, that I lost my balance a little bit. It has to do with we will never hold our balance. We want to find our balance. If sometimes we don't find the balance straight away, it's better to bring down the foot and then try again, instead of just holding the balance, staying there. Anyway, after doing out three times here, then I work, work with the ankle joints three times, shift the weight, sink down, work with the ankle joints three times, down, move up, down, do a big turning here, then I bend forward, doing three times here, in this direction, and I do it three times in the other direction, finishes off, up here, down, expand, 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 move in, move in, move in, down, and three breathing here, three breathing here, shaking, and closing. This is roughly how we do it. I'll do it with a bit more detail now, going a little more into it. Mm -hmm. 